are full of doubt right now or your realities is just you are full of worries or the things that is uncertain. So, the, <laughs> the recent vlog, kahapon lang po yun. And praise the Lord for coming from Cadiz. We are now here at Pasi City to have the youth camp of Pasi together with Sector Head. Valiant Palencia. And yun, si Javi po ulit. Welcome back, Javi. <laughs> so, before po, we start this vlog, pasay sa salosit po muna namin kayo na praise the Lord. Full of doubt right now, or your realities is just you are full of worries or the things that is uncertain. And for this vlog, my dear Kadamol, uh, we will just simply share about courage. So, yun po no, uh, time check it's uh, 4:35. Salamat no, we have two brothers here from the leaders of the different sectors. Siguro, we will just ask them of what is courage for them. Okay, let's do this. So, they're already pressured. I am giving them one minute to do it. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, okay. You know, and actually, Valiant is already in my vlog. Siguro sa my day number two ng Icon vlog ko sa Davao. Still pressure pa rin sila after mga 10 minutes na po. For me, courage is your way to be brave. And nabala nga, you are brave to show and express the love of the Lord to others. And for that, we got to be blessed. You know? For me, courage is the ability to to do something who frightens you. And for me, I'll get encouraged is by it's a gift of the Lord. It's a gift of the Lord for us. For each and every one of us. And for the past days, so for the past months, I've been low. <laughs> uh, I've questioned some, some people now. And for them, courage is somehow going out of their, of their own comfort zones. But for me, naman, courage is somehow facing yourself so that is why we will talk about courage how would be able to face ourselves we are afraid of new things no no mga this is the thing that stops us to grow our lack of courage so if you want to grow face your fear have the courage put your trust on god and not in yourself so there are two things lang po no? Courage to accept and courage is all about yes and no. So having the courage to accept, it's like yes, I am a sinner. Yes, I am a sinner. I am doubtful. I'm afraid to try new things. I'm afraid to go out of my comfort zone. All of these things, no, lahat lahat po ito are the ones na kailangan natin i-accept. So first is, courage to accept your own realities. Secondly, courage is about yes and no. Courage to say yes and courage to say no. So you know what? We are living in a world that marami na po tayong alam. Pero more than that, we have this wisdom coming from the Lord to really know what is good and what is not. If it doesn't lead you to a better you, then have the courage to say no. If it leads you to be better, then say yes. That's all you need. Courage. Say yes and no. As I end, my dear Kadol, um, I just want to share this short line coming from the book uh, that I'm reading. Uh, the title of the book is Sacred Obsession. The first chapter. This is the thing.
thing that really captured me most. What you pursue is what you become. Again, what you pursue is what you become. Holy or unholy. As I end mga kadumol, I just want to ask you uh, sa mga followers ko dyan, please comment down below your story of courage. For that, pahalubila sa isa't isa. I would like also to know, to know your stories as well para din makita ng mga followers na iba na subscribers na iba your stories as well baka a story nyo will be their inspiration right? also you can share it sa mga kilala nyo na kailangan madinig ito courage of acceptance courage to say no and to say yes and that's it mga kaibigan again and again continue to dream on laban bye